Hello friends, so this is Umesh Arva from CADCAM Social Media and today we will create this model in Annex CAD and here we have four views one is top view and one is front view so this is the front view okay from here you can see that is front view and this is sectional top view this is the section from the CC is made of this edit section okay so we will start from the top and first I will create this this one this, this portion and I will extrude this up to this 40 uh, 54 so I will extrude it 54 so let's start with the annex CAD okay uh, first I will select this sketch and I will create this top view at XY plane and XY orientation and first I will create this and center will be at this point so start with the rectangle and this is my rectangle and make it coincide with the origin and this distance is 110 so apply 110 sorry and the width width of this is 85 change it to 85 and I don't require this line so convert it to construction and draw one more line above this now select this line and this line So this gap is uh, 176 minus 104 divided by 2 that is 33. So this length is 33 and this is also 33 and same here same this value is also the same. So I will change it 33. Now. I have to draw this this portion this is a circular portion so this thing you can see here so here is one hole so I will start a line uh, a little bit far from the axis and draw ok now I will dimension it uh, 36 is the diameter so I will change this gap is 37 divided by 2 ok and this is 85 so half of 85 85 divided by 2 that's it and the length is the total length is the total length is from this start point to end is 150 175 close and one, one semicircle is there so draw a rectangle circle and trim it now dimension this the radius is 8 and close it now exit for the sketch and first I will extrude this portion the limits are symmetrical and the thickness is 54 the height is 54 divided by 2 and apply C now uh, some round so select radius and the radius is 54 half of 54 is 27 27 apply ok so round is coming and here 42 is the outer and 12 is inner radius the first 12 apply and outer is 42 and ok now I will select this revolve command for this portion so go to revolve 
and change here this curve to region bounding curve this portion and this both about the axis axis is my this x axis select x axis and the point is default origin and angle is 360 degree and okay see how it looks now i have to draw a cylinder here on this face and later i will cut it so a sketch over this plane and create a circle and the diameter of this circle is 115 and close finish now i have to remove this band this fillets remove this and extrude choose this extrude command and select reverse the direction and this thickness is this thickness is equal to this means 33 and it must be unite with the body and hide this curve now we will apply the fillet the fillet is 12 see now it looks properly now this hole for this hole go to extrude and change face edge and no it is not selecting it properly so i will unite these both so a common face will come extrude and face edge and reverse the direction and cut it throughout okay one more thing if you want to check this we have one option here that is section with the help of this section we can match see this portion is matching only this rib is remaining here one hole is remaining here and this portion is also remaining so cancel it add this sketch this fillet is not coming properly so remove this now we will select this fillet 42 okay now it is smooth here we have some see this 30 mm rib so select this plane and draw a curve from this starting so i will select this click 85 so this dimension is 85 half of 85 and close it and the radius is 70 and close my sketch is fully constrained or uh, we can do one thing uh, i will mirror it just select this curve and mirror because we have two ribs on the both side so finish and here in more we have this rib and select single curve a single curve with this and the thickness is 30 and it will automatically distribute on the both side same on the opposite side now this all are matching one fillet is there this is 13 okay so select this 
थर्टी आगे ओके विथ जस्ट वन बाय वन इट इज लुकिंग लाइक अ थर्टी Okay, we will see it at the last. So just on the face, draw a circle. Okay, this is my hole, this hole, this center twenty-seven is the diameter. So change is twenty-seven, and one more circle is here. This is fifty-four is the diameter. So draw one more circle. Of diameter, fifty-four. Fifty-four is this outer, but we need this forty-eight. So change it to forty-eight and close it. Finish this sketch. Now extrude this forty-eight diameter circle, and this thickness is. Okay, this gap is hundred uh, and minus hundred and four. Six is the difference, and three is here, and three is here. So I will change it to three. And in opposite side, this thickness is thirty-three plus three. Means thirty-six minus thirty-six, and see. Okay, apply. Okay, it must be unite. So we have to select this unite, apply, and again select this inner circle and cut it. Now subtract. So this is the geometry, and in first sketch we have selected. This dimension is what we have selected, 176. Okay, something is missing here. Uh, I have taken this distance, this outer one, but we have to uh, take this one. Means 176 minus 3 plus 36. So this value must be 170. So again, I will go to my previous sketch, and I will change. This distance to thirty. Same here, thirty, and same here, thirty, and close. Now exit. Now delete. So rib. Add it. This rib. So first, this is radius. Okay. So. I am deleting this. Delete this, and extrude this. Extrude, okay. So, added this. Why this is coming? This one, add it. This is thirty, and unite. Now extrude. Okay. 
this is for cut so now cut is okay and here this is sketch sketch for drip so before this i have to select this outer edges and apply the radius is 40 to now select this this curve are properly and rip this rib is and again another rib is radius and another radius no problem I will check it at the last now everything is okay I am going to mirror this about this plane and okay okay so only one this hole is remaining this hole is remaining so select this plane and draw a circle and align with and this gap is 38 so dimension 38 and this whole dimension is this hole is 10 diameter now finish this sketch and cut it subtract and ok see hide all the sketches Uh, this fillet is 3 mm, 3 millimeter. So select 3 millimeter and select here 3 millimeter and click apply. And this fillet is remaining, but this is not possible here. It is not taking this radius as 30. It is coming like so. I will use some another method. So delete it. Now I will trim this whole body with this plane and I will keep this portion where the fillet is coming now I will mirror this so go to insert and here in S shade copy we have this mirror geometry so select this and select the plane and ok now if you want to join this use this join or ok so this is our model hope you understand this and if you have any queries please comment and if you feel this is useful for you please like comment and share this video thank you for watching and have a nice day